chicken breast that needed to be cooked up. So what I did is I took those and I just split them in half. It was just two chicken breasts. Cut them in half. I added some salt and some lemon pepper seasoning to those. And then a little bit of teriyaki sauce just right over the top and fast. Let's go ahead and add this more because Oh, it just makes it yummy and sounds good when I sizzle. Okay, and um, so for my veggies, um, I just still have some carrots left over, so I just slice those in half, and, and I just kind of put those in the griddle along with my chicken. So they're just kind of, you know, cooking through, down a little bit. And then I also added um, a little bit of garlic underneath my bed of butter that I cooked my chicken on. So, you know, butter, garlic, chicken, and a little bit of a glaze. It's delicious. Um, and then I am taking a very quick store shortcut. And you will see in this pot um, is that lovely boil in a bag rice. Um, and it cooks in about 8 to 10 minutes. It literally boils in the bag. Um, so it's just white rice. It's all it is. And so what I'm going to do with that is I'm going to take my lime, and you see I have my baby zester right here. Never lie, but my baby zester because she does great things. Um, but I'm just going to, when the rice is done, I'll pull that out. I'm going to drain it off. I'm going to zest the lime, and then I'm, I roll it to kind of get the juices flowing. And then I'm just going to cut it and squeeze the juice into my white rice. Because I don't know about you guys, but white rice very boring and so I add some um, seasoned herbs, I'm sorry, some sea salt, I grind up some sea salt, add that to my white rice with my lime zest and my lime juice and the lime along with the um, teriyaki and the carrots just kind of bring it all together, almost like a stir fry. So, you know, it wasn't a planned meal. But it's going to be a delicious meal. So, here we go. That's what's cooking in Jackie's house tonight. Alright, so my chicken is done. I just took it off on the chopping block. Just cut it up into little bite-sized pieces. And it's just kind of resting on the hot griddle just so it stays warm. I have taken my lime and zested it added some butter now I'm gonna add the sea salt and I'm gonna squeeze the juice of a lime in and we're gonna take a peek and see what this looks like at the end all plated up and here we go here's our finished result glazed carrots and some garlic teriyaki lemon pepper chicken with some lime flavored rice. So an unprepared meal simply with just what I had in the pantry tonight and I still feel good about serving it. So I don't feel guilty at all. Hope you enjoy. Have fun in your pantry.